What's going on guys, it's Kitty here and welcome back to another one of my videos. On today's video we're looking at Gods of Olympus and in particular I'm going to go through and talk about the last of our gods in the underworld which is Majira and she is the jealous fury who punishes crimes of infidelity and she is the master of poison. But before we go in and talk about that, make sure you subscribe to this channel and click that bell notification so you don't miss any of my future uploads. And if you want to be in with a chance of winning a thousand gems a week, then come along to my Discord server, which is in the link below. And every Tuesday I do a live stream and I announce the winner of that thousand gems. So it's an awesome place to be. Make sure you get there. And let's talk about Majira. And like I said, she is the last of the Furies. She's got the same health and strength as the other two Furies when she's level at 60. I've got on 60 on here. So the first ability is called Drain. Give allies the ability to drain health as they deal damage. Now that's going to be a very interesting one to see in effect. To be able to give the other gods the ability to take health as they deal damage. I'm interested to see that myself. The second ability that Magira has got is called Poison. Create a cloud of poison to deliver damage over a period of time. That one also sounds pretty interesting to me. And finally, the ultimate for Majira is called Plague. Creates a disease which can eliminate a huge number of troops in a short period of time. Now that reminds because with all these gods, their ultimates, some of them remind me a little of the original gods, the Olympic City gods. And... The plague one reminds me a little bit of Hawkstorm. I wonder if it's going to have that sort of effect. Now the Alliance power is called Poison. Creates a small cloud of poison, like a little miniature version of the... All these are like a miniature version of the abilities, the ultimate abilities. Create a small cloud of poison to deliver damage over a short period of time. And Megira's environment is called Acheron. The Underworld River of Pain boosts Poison Towers, so like We've said about before, you've got your fire tower, you've got your ice tower, and you've got your poison tower. And I'll be talking about those in the final video of the Spotlight series. These are the boosts you get. 100% increase on the health, strength, and range of the poison towers. And the statue of Majira has a 50% health boost as well. So if you look at this map now with the Majira, you can see... All that lovely green like poison river effect going round. It looks pretty cool. All of these look pretty cool really and you can see the towers I've got at the top there. So we're going to go in and we're going to do a couple of attacks and we're going to have a look at these effects. Probably going to take Hades in with us and see how impressive Majira is in battle. So we're going to take Majira in with Hades and do two or three fights and see how effective those three abilities are the Drain, the Poison, and the Plague. So here we go, level 40 on Poseidon. We're going to put Hades in first, then Majira afterwards. And we're going to put that Plague into effect, which will poison any troops. And then the actual, her second ability of Poison as well, which helps damage the buildings. You can see there's like a green circle of effect. And the thing with Majira is... She's got a range, so you can actually target specific buildings and take them out from a distance. And you can also use that drain effect as well. There goes the drain. And that should be helping Hades as well in doing some damage. Like the effect of poison and plague together is very good at taking out masses of troops. If you've got a lot of troop problems going on, then Majira is the one to help solve those problems. You see they're systematically taking this out. What I do like about Majira is the fact that she is she is a range. I do like, you know, I've always liked Artemis. I've always liked the, you know, the, the staying at the back and getting it getting the job done from a distance, a safe distance, which means she won't get caught out by any explosive damage. Let's go in. We'll do one more fight. Here we go, level 45. And again, we'll start at the top side. We'll put Hades down, then Majira. 
And we'll use that plague again. And we're going to use the drain this time. Taking out the buildings. One by one. Put some more skeletons down. And then... So like this, you can just pick. I'll just go for the flame tower. And she's sort of protected. She's sort of hiding behind Hades. Put some poison in. And this should affect the circle. There's a circle of effect. You can see the circle of effect there. And it's sort of doing some damage. The troops are all getting poisoned as they come through. They're slowly dying. So I can get Majira. And I can take out these buildings here. I can target them from a distance. And let's go poison again. All the, any, any troops going in that area get, will get poisoned. Let's have a look. You can see. There you go. There's the... There's like the... The fish men. And they're getting poisoned. Although they're quite strong now. And that is it. Job is done. Poison is good. I do like it. I think out of the three Furies... She might even be my favourite. They're all really good. Fire, ice, poison. I love it. So that is the final god that I've got to show you. And I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you did enjoy today's video, if you can smash that like button because that would be super awesome. A few shout outs to Dominic M, Tommy the Beast, Eddie Shukla, Percy and Fluffy. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel. And I'll have a couple of videos for you to watch. Just to hear. Bye for now.